All right, I, I want to talk a few lock-in strategies. So we are coming into lock-in. That starts in that starts April first, and this is the season you got to be a little bit more creative on on who you're marketing to and your marketing approaches. So our approach is number one is you have current clients, right? You did a bunch of business for AEP, or or you may have a book of business. So the first thing you need to do is I'd send out letters to those people. I think handwritten letters are the best way to do it. Talking about the other services you provide. I talked about annuities and life insurance in some of my other videos. So your book of business is one of the best sources of, of, of leads that you, that you could ever have because you have a connection with those people. I'm telling you guys, don't be the agent that says, I'm just going to keep on adding to my you know, adding to, to my book of business and I'm not going to maintain and develop relationships with my existing because that's a recipe for, for failure. Excuse me, that's a recipe for failure. So your existing book, that is the amount of business that's in that is uh, you, you got to work it. You got to work it. So first thing, existing book, I would, I would do letters to those people, handwritten letters. I would also do phone calls to those people. Just do a, a touch base. It can be a retention call. How, hey, how's your plan doing? Is it, is it doing okay by you guys, by you? Do you have any questions? Oh, by the way, this is some other things I do. Could I come by, run an illustration, da 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 da. The other thing is T65. I think T65 business, doing direct mail is really good. I, we pulled away from it from, for a little bit for maybe direct mail. I think what I've seen is maybe come back, it's come back a little bit. We've done some mail here recently. We got a good return. So what I would do during lock-in is, is focus on some T65 business. So do some direct mail. We do some incentives and co-op on that. So you know, do some direct mail, T65. It's great business. You can sell all these, you can sell all these products, uh, Medicare, life insurance, annuities to people like that. The next thing I would say is DSNP. You can do a lot of DSNP this time of year. You know, I have agents who they're writing as much DSNP business during lock-in as they're writing through the rest of the year. They're right, they're just going full tilt on DSNP. Next is CSNP. If your state has a chronic special needs plan, you can write people who are on a who have some type of chronic illness. So they might have diabetes or heart issues. You can write those people year-round. The next thing I would do for, for lock-in are American Legions, VFWs, and any place that's, that veterans hang out. There might be like a veterans expo in your town or, or you know, any place that you can be creative to connect with veterans. So you can write them with certain carriers. Connect with us to find out which carriers you can write them with during lock-in. But some carriers, you can write veterans year-round on the MA only plans. You can do it because they have something called other credible coverage through their VA. They get the prescriptions through the VA and that counts as a special election period you can write year round. So I would be writing veterans year round and I would tell you this guys, veterans are a great play because a lot of times they have higher income. They might have, they might be have, have an opportunity for a life insurance or an annuity. Um, you know, it's an end. A lot of these places, they're like a restaurant. I didn't know this until we did a few events there, but these VFWs, it's like a restaurant, and people who aren't veterans go in there just to have, you know, to have a nice, uh, tasty, cheap meal. And so we've written business of people who are who are Medicare supplement clients who go in there to get to get lunch. You know, I, I, we did an event, and I bet you half the people that we sat down with, they had a Medicare supplement. I couldn't believe it. So just because we're going to lock-in doesn't mean that you shouldn't be and you can't be writing tons of business during lock-in. And I, I would tell you this, use lock-in as a way to get better at marketing. You have to be more creative. You got to think outside the box and you need to look at that challenge as a way to stretch and, and grow and do better. And when you do that, guess how much better of an agent you're going to be by by marketing to your existing clients, talking about retention, talking about other products, looking at different ways to market yourself. How much better are you gonna be during the seasons that are 
easier to sell, like AEP and OEP. So use, use lock-in as your season to stretch, grow, understand other products, talk to your clients about, about, about other products, market in different ways. You're going you're going to you, you're going to be a better agent when you master lock-in.